Hi, um, I'm Jenna. I am a first year master's student here at Trent in psychology and I specialize in cognitive psychology. In December of 2021, I suffered a stroke-like episode. Recovery has been a wild roller coaster. Um, I've honestly loved every minute. I have given it my all. I am really doing well. I have made huge milestones. I have learned to walk again, talk again. <laughs> I've really been able to overcome a lot of challenges, um, but I've also gained a totally new perspective on life. No one else gets to experience their first. I get to remember the first time I took steps. That's pretty cool. No one else really gets that. And it's really just made me grateful for the world that I have and the life I have. I don't understand this world and I don't really feel like I fit in. You all have so much more than I have in terms of memories and understanding. But I think I have a more unique perspective. I was kind of robbed of 21 years of my life and I'm not willing to waste any more or be robbed of any more. It's out of my control if this will happen again. I'm gonna live my life to the fullest and I'm gonna try and pack as much understanding and knowledge into my little brain as I can while I have it um, and just really thrive in my environment right now. Trent has been amazing for me. I honestly don't know what I would have done without school. School was a major driving force in my recovery. School in general gave me that push that I needed in my recovery. But also in terms of support, I my core group of friends are people I met at Trent. If I hadn't have come to Trent, I probably wouldn't have met them. We all come from so many different places and backgrounds that I don't think our paths would have crossed. And one other thing is my supervisors have just been phenomenal. So Trent has really just brought my recovery together and helped me move forward. A lot of my support team have been telling me like you should write a book like this is really inspirational and your story is so unique and cool you need to share it and to me I don't see it that way I'm just a normal gal who I have dreams and I want to achieve them. To me it was just not an option to stop. I It wasn't a question of if I was going to walk again, it was just when I was going to walk again. So I sat down and I just started writing and it turned out to be really therapeutic. I wrote and all of a sudden it was 2 a.m. and I had like 30 pages of writing and I was like, wow, this is actually, this is pretty good. Um, so then I continued writing because I felt just so well after it. Next thing I knew, I had half a book and I was put into contact with the publisher who picked up my story immediately. We connected so well and she was like, this needs to be told. And next thing I know, I have a book and it's unbelievable. To me, sharing this book now, for one, it offers a little insight into me. I really struggle to find the words to explain what it's like and just if I can, I guess, inspire someone, that's pretty cool. I don't really see my story as inspiring, but other people have told me they do. I just want to help the world a little. I lost my voice during my stroke. Once I gained it back, I vowed I would do everything to use it. This book is me using my voice.